Hey there, Jasper fans. Welcome inside Manhattan Athletics here in the Morrow Broadcast Studio on the Jasper Sports Network. I'm Joe Hutter, joined by the head coach of the Manhattan women's basketball team, John Olinowski. Coach, great start to the season so far. 4-4 four four overall, 2-0 and oh in MAC play with wins over Niagara and Quinnipiac this past weekend. What have you liked from the team so far? Well, I think we are, we're starting to get consistent. Um, we've won three of the last four. Um, against Niagara, we had a really good offensive game. We scored 80 points. And against Quinnipiac, we played really solid defense. And um, we scored 52, and they only scored 42. So our defense really uh, came through for us against a very, very strong quality opponent. So I like the fact that we're getting better. I like the fact that we're getting a little more consistent. And uh, we're getting a lot of really, really good um, uh, production from a number of players. Well, defense has really been key for this team so far. We'll talk about a little bit of what you liked from Crystal Ross and Monty Tatum, two players who have had significant contributions and impacts on the floor so far. Yeah, well, Monty's been, uh, Monty's been great all season long. She's our leading scorer. Um, I think she's either first or second in the MAC in steals. Um, and uh, she kind of runs the show for us, whatever, plays really good defense. And uh, she's been a, a really consistent player for us all year long. Um, so she's meant so much to us and Crystal gives us another big inside presence and um, she's had some monster quarters for us or whatever. Um, you know, I, I think uh, Niagara, she had 14 points in the second half and against Quinnipiac, she had eight points in the third quarter when we really needed some offensive production. So she stepped up nicely and she's a really good rebounder and shot blocker as well. So both those two players have been uh, a godsend for us this year. and have really propelled us into a really nice position. Well, through eight games, team has done a number of things well. What do you hope to continue now stepping back into non-conference play to finish that up strongly before going back into MAC play? Well, I just hope that we can continue to have great play. Um, you know, all our seniors are stepping up nicely. Blake Underhill is running the point really nice. And Kyla Champagne and Shannon Erickson are doing a great job. And, um, you know, some of our younger players are stepping up. So we hope that uh, we can get you know, great production from, from all of our players and that we can um, uh, get a little better execution on the offensive end and uh, just keep getting better on a daily basis. Well, the upcoming slate for this team includes a couple teams that made it to the tournament last year. Uh, you have Holy Cross coming up next and St. Francis, Brooklyn and American in the next three contests for this team. What are you looking for in those matchups? Three very tough games. Um, Holy Cross is uh, always really, really strong, especially up there. They play extremely well up in Worcester, and um, they're so well coached. Um, they've got a really good inside-outside game, so we've got to play very, very well um, to, to be able to compete uh, with them up there on Saturday. And then St. Francis of Brooklyn won the NEC last year, and uh, John's done a tremendous job with that program. So. Um, they're another quality opponent coming in on Friday. And then that Sunday we go to American who um, actually won their conference, made the tournament, and um, is a very, very good team, well coached, and uh, they do a great job uh, with, their, with their program. Well, the Jaspers return to action on Saturday when they took on Holy Cross. Saturday afternoon, head coach of the Manhattan women's basketball team, John Olanowski, thanks for joining us. Thank you, Joe. I appreciate it. Thanks. And fans, thanks for joining us inside Manhattan Athletics here on the Jasper Sports Network.